808s are amazing. They play a huge role in making your beat sound full and finished. Rappers will be standing in line to purchase your beats. That is, if your 808s are tuned correctly, of course. If it's not, your beat will sound like this. Although tuning isn't everything, they also need to be in key with your melody. When you play the C note on your keyboard, you want FL Studio to actually play a C note. If the sample in your browser is a D note, FL will play a D note when hitting the C note. Watch that again if you didn't get it. We need to find out what note the 808 sample plays. To do that, right click it and select Audio Editor. Now Edison will open up and here you can see the waveform. Click the Regions button and choose Detect Pitch Regions. Here you can see that the original sample is playing a D note. You need to remember that D note for a second. Now drag the 808 sample to the channel rack. Click it and here you can see the sample properties. Click the envelope icon and at the bottom you can see the piano keys. If you left click him, you'll play the sample and if you right click him, you will tell FL what note the 808 is playing. We found out that the 808 is a D, so all you need to do now is right click on the D note. Now the 808 is tuned, however you still need to find a way to make it fit with the melody. Let me help you out. The 808 will sound best as a D note, so we're gonna make a melody in the D minor key. Head over to the menu on top and select view, then note how highlighting. Select the minor natural one on the right and then the D on the left. Let's create a very simple melody by only using the highlighted notes. I'm gonna make sure that the D is gonna be the most prominent and leading. That sounds cool. Now, before we're gonna make an 808 pattern, we need to make sure it's set to cut itself. This prevents the notes from overlapping, which sounds like this. Terrible, we don't want that. Head over to the piano roll and draw in a D note, since our melody also starts with a D. Create a pattern like this, and once that's done, you can experiment with other notes, but make sure to stay within the highlighted notes. Using the same notes as the melody would be even better. This is what I came up with. The 808 is tuned and it works with the melody, but if you still don't know how to make unique patterns, all the information you've just learned is useless. Click here to make sure your time doesn't go to waste. So, what are you still doing here? Let's go, see you there.